welcome. I'm super excited to do today's video. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm so excited. I forgot. My name is Prue or Prue Luru and I do a lot of videos about makeup. Uh, so just recently I got my Sydney Grace Christmas in July haul that I posted up and I've laid out the actually show you. So I have uh, 50 singles. Oh, this is like the dangerous part of these Ugh, Inglet palettes. I know I need to like get into a different brand of <laughs> palettes because these are meant to be able to like so you slide it. Sorry. And share it from shit Jonathan told me the other day. This happens to me every time. <laughs> that you can stack them without the lids. Um, I'm regretting that decision. I think I'm going to put the lids back on. But I do want to buy more single palettes, but I, I'm so fussy with the styles. So, tell me about your favorite single, like, empty custom palettes that I can put my singles in, please. I need one. And my beautiful friend, Annette, and Annette's Makeup Corner, has been using the Smashbox Lid Primer, so I had to jump on that one. And I, I don't know, I'm, like, obsessed with trying eye primers, so I'm so excited. Have I told you what we're doing? Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> so today I thought it would be cool to sit down and do a singles palette roulette with my Sydney Grace shadows. Uh, a few of you seemed receptive to that idea and it's been a little while since I've filmed a roulette of my singles. And I really want to do it more regularly because I, I do love doing this. I have loaded up all my singles from Sydney Grace in my Tiny Decisions app. And here we go. Our first one is Perfect Storm. So to start up, and next up is Regal. Though I've written them all out, I don't actually know like what they all look like. Oh, I would never guess that it's a purple. Regal. And next up, Magenta Dreams. Ooh. Oh, okay. That is a beautiful shimmer. What have we got next? Key Lime. Oh, it's a dark green. Wow. Cali. I've picked this one up because then times today it should be this one. Another blue. So it's like a lighter blue. I wrote one more. Mint green. We were so close to one of the uh, shifters. But mint green is beautiful too. There it is. All right. And that is the shadows. That we're going to use today. So I've primed my eyes. Shall we bring you in? What do I want to do? How am I going to do? I keep trying to talk myself out of doing like my favorite style with the triangle. Just love it so. I'm going to go in with key lime. Wait, let me make it look a little bit prettier in here. Key lime. Bring you in a little bit. Should we just try and bring it out? Look, what I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try not do it so harshly, maybe. Hmm. How far in do I want it? We're gonna bring it here. Alright, the brush is getting a bit too tiny. That was the Morphe M149. I have multiples. I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. crease brush. Uh, the Morphe one is beautiful for like cute detail work, but it can take a while. Beautiful. All right. I'm enjoying this brush today, so let's keep using it. Then going in with Perfect Storm. I'm going to bring this over and into my crease. I was just wondering if I should use the purple. Oh, I should use the purple. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to get that. So I've just mixed a bit of that purple in and I'm going to bring it down into here. So I forgot what shade it was. Was it Regal? It's Regal. So I've gone into Regal instead. It just needed to be something a little bit darker than that blue. Though the blue, the perfect solvent is a beautiful shade. And then now into Perfect Storm. Same brush, cleaned it off. Mm. 
using Cali. I'm going to bring this around into sort of here, like the inner part of my eye. And then down and around. And then I'm going to go back to Perfect Storm. Sorry, I should have done this before. But I'm just going to use this underneath my eye. I'm going to do a little bit of cut crease. So I'm going to use my Anastasia primer for this. Tiny little dot. So I'm going to dab some on both eyes. Oh, I should do that eye trick, shouldn't I? There we are. Artificial creases. And then I'm going to guess that you probably already know what shade it's going to be. Did I already forget the name of the shade though? Yes. Magenta Dreams. Which just looks like a blue purple duochrome. I don't know. Let's see. We'll lay down a nice base for it so it should shine. I feel like I need to see how it performs my finger. Just move on a little bit smooth. Oh yes. All right. Beautiful. Then going in with, is it mint cream or mint dream? Mint green. I'm going to bring this up and in the corner and a little bit around here. And then I'm going to go back in with Regal. And I just want to blend it in a little bit more with this shade. Just so we don't have any harsh edges. Going back in with Key Lime. I'm just seeing a bit patchiness over here. Which I want to fix. Let's just blend out the top. <laughs> I think that's a little bit better. I don't know. What do you think? I'm feeling insecure about my makeup today. <clears throat> right. I'm going to duck off and do my waterline mascara. I'll be back. Alright, so I've got Maybelline The Falsies Waterproof Mascara on and Pants from Colourpop. In my waterline. Sorry, I don't know why I zoomed you out. Here is the final look. I think I'm not like super into the green on the outer part. I think I made it work as much as I did. I did go a little bit more in with Magenta Dreams and just blend it a little bit further across. I don't know if it did much. <laughs> but it's kind of a fun look. It's growing on me. I don't know. Let me know where if you... Yeah. It's a fun look. I like it. It's not bad. <laughs> and that pop. Ooh. I love that mint green on the inner corner. That shimmer is beautiful. I'm excited. I can do way more of these videos <laughs> with just my Sydney Grace shadows. I think my next one, I'll probably do all of my ColourPop singles because I got a lot of them. And it's fun to be forced into doing a look with colors that you might not have paired together and play around with my singles a little bit more. I love having a chance to get creative with my makeup. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. I absolutely appreciate and adore you. Uh, if you're new here, I'd love it if you consider subscribing. It would mean the world to me. Anyway, I absolutely appreciate and adore you. Mwah.